Let's meet the visitors, the Minnesota Timberwolves. At point guard, Mike Conley. At small forward, Jaden McDaniels. At center, Rudy Gobert. At the other forward position, Carl Anthony Towns. At the other guard position, Anthony Edwards. The head coach of the visiting team is Chris Finch. in the NBA and its global fan base. And in our matchup tonight, we'll see the Minnesota Timberwolves going up against the Los Angeles Lakers here on their home floor in L.A. And our broadcast team tonight, Grant Hill and Steve Smith. Allie LaForce, our reporter. Let's see some of the numbers here for Carl Anthony Towns. And he's gone cold over the last 10 games, guys. His scoring numbers are down, and he can't seem to get out of this rough patch. He's got to get himself going tonight, or they'll start losing patience with him. And a look at Minnesota's opening lineup. Conley at the guard with Edwards next to him. Inside, we got Towns and Gobert. And it's McDaniels in at the three, the small forward. And for the Lakers, D'Lo and Reeves are the backcourt duo. It's LeBron at power forward with AD as the center. And it's Achimura in at the three. And this late in the season, Grant, would you say the adage, nobody is 100% rings true? 100%. I mean, at least that was the case for me. <laughs> There's some truth in that saying, though, for everyone. Most guys might not be 100% until they get a full off-season arrest. James passes to Davis. James against Towns. Back to James. Clock at six. Davis with a screen on Towns. And it's James with the three. Tough to be that consistent from range. For that long, LeBron defying the odds. Pass to Edwards. Go bear with it. Back to Edwards. Now Conley. McDaniels with it. Hachimura covering. Go bear with a screen on Russell. And here's Edwards outside. Counted from distance. Oh, there's another three. Love seeing Edwards deliver the revenge triple. James finds Russell. Over Conley. The shot by Russell, no good. And it's Conley with the ball for Minnesota. Outplayed in their previous game on their schedule, losing to the Cavs. Yeah, they found some decent looks, but the shots just weren't falling. <laughs> Sometimes it goes like that. They never really got into a rhythm, despite trying a few different things. Sometimes it's just not your night. Davis, the pass to Russell. James, outside. Pass to Davis. 
watching Murrow from long range. And another three for the Lakers. That's what Davis can provide for you. Gave his man such a great look. Knocked loose. McDaniels passes to Edwards to the inside. The kick out to Conley. Here's Edwards, guarded by Russell. Let's it go from 14. And Edwards Anthony with the basket Edwards. on the assist by Conley. Edwards got five. Exceptional pass from Conley. Love seeing him involve his guys like this. James outside. From 11 feet away, here's Davis. And again, it's the Lakers. We're already seeing a little rhythm out of this offense. They've hit three out of four so far. Smitty, part of what makes LeBron James so inspiring is how competitive he is still. B.A., I don't think he'll ever lose that fire in his eyes. But you're right, he's still hungry. Every game, even the little ones, LeBron wants to win just as bad as ever. Edwards for three. Great start so far. Anthony three Edwards. of three in this one. And, and this is how confident Edwards is. Feels like he can sink these shots whenever he wants. James passes to Achimura. Here's Reeves. For three, James. And another three for the Lakers. They have really found a rhythm here early. Four for five to start this game. Outside McDaniels. Back to Conley. Pass to Edwards. Now here's McDaniels. The three ball. Rebound, Anthony Davis. And here in the first quarter, a little over three and a half minutes play. Edwards, the pass to Towns. Nice dish, oh, and the layup goes Anthony down. Towns. A big man, Carl Anthony Towns. No problem taking a little contact. Pass to Reeves. And here's Russell. He's guarded by Conley. And another three for the Lakers. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. Now here's Edwards. Give him eight. Conley finds McDaniels. Towns outside. Launches it. The shot comes out. And so Davis will bring it up for Los Angeles. They lead by four. They defeated Milwaukee in their last game. <laughs> A big difference in that one. They're ability to convert from range. By and large, they took some really good shots. And if it wasn't there, each guy was willing to make the extra pass. Trust in his teammates. Now here's Conley. No made baskets yet. Here's Towns. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. And at nearly seven feet tall, you don't expect Towns to do some of the things he does, like drain threes and make savvy passes. But he's a modern big man. Anthony Towns. Taking two shots. And that one falls for Towns. When you discuss the Minnesota Timberwolves, what would you say about their front office, Grant? Well, B.A., they want to be as competitive as possible. Whether it's who they are drafting, trading for, or signing in free agency, this team's goal is to be taken seriously out west. No good on the second free throw. You know, since the Lakers moved to L.A. in 1960, they've had the most sustained success in the NBA. Well, think about this, B.A. From West to Magic to Kobe to LeBron, they always have a superstar. And NBA players love living in L.A. And the city loves basketball. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Towns on a screen. From the high post. And he hits oh, the jumper. Anthony. Towns has got five. They're getting him shots in his spots. That's understanding your personnel. James finds Russell. There's Davis with the three. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Last time they met in Minneapolis. 
They barely got the win the last time these teams faced off. And in large part, I think it was because they were pushing the action and drawing foul calls. As long as they maintain that same aggressiveness, they should be in solid shape to come away victorious again. Trying to slice into this deficit every time up the floor. Terrific quarter for him. James, outside. With the 10-footer, basket counts. LeBron Give him eight points now. So smooth from the mid-range. LeBron knows when to fire. Russell against Conley. Pass to Towns. Gobert is double. Jacks up a three. That's good from Towns. Oh, On the assist from Towns. Gobert. The Lakers have gotten seven of their ten shots to fall. Hachimura outside. And on both sides of the ball, Rui Hachimura plays with a great aggression. Grant, he embraces that part of his game. You can't ignore the physicality that he plays with. Rui is at his best when he's playing bully ball. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And both free throws good for Achimura. The Timberwolves trail. Conley with the ball. Still without a bucket. Pass to Towns. Gobert with it. Outside Conley. Takes a three. Rebound Anthony Davis. Davis has got five rebounds in the game. Now Russell. Inside. Davis hits. Davis has got his second basket of the game. You see the weight that Hades added to his frame over the years. Now invites contact. Conley passes to Edwards. And the layup is good off the glass. Edwards has got 12 points. Off to a great start. Five straight from the field. Right wing. Russell against Conley. Russell has to read. Hachimura outside. No good with the triple. And so Conley will bring it up for the T-Wolves. They trail by three. Outside Edwards. There's a screen. Puts up a three. Davis with a rebound. Davis has got six rebounds here tonight. Here's James. Towns with a rebound. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. Pass to Edwards. And here's the fast break. And the ball out of play. Timberwolves will have it. And checking out the leaderboard. You've probably been watching these guys own the glass since the All-Star break. Second is Rudy Gobert. And of course, Anthony Davis. One look at the numbers, and it's obvious these two have become dominant forces in the paint over this stretch. Prince has checked in for LeBron. The Timberwolves also with a sub. Anderson's checked in for Anthony Edwards. Here's Conley. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Outside, Anderson to the right side. Conley against Russell. It's good. Masterful control by Mike Conley, keeping his eyes on the rim and nailing the shot through contact. That's to Prince. Russell against Conley. Fades and shoots. The shot by Russell, no good. Easy chance for mid-range. Wouldn't be surprised to see them run that play again. Russell against Conley. Towns a screen on Russell. 
Elbow shot. That one rolls around and rims out. The Lakers in the lead. Achimura, the pass to Reeves. Back to Achimura. And out of bounds. Minnesota will have it. Minnesota ball. With the playoffs around the corner. Let's see how the West is shaping up. Taking a look at the Timberwolves with great effort over a long season. They're That's second in the conference. Board. And of course the Lakers, they're ninth in the conference. Seeing where the Timberwolves are, their fans were expecting a lot from this team this year and they haven't disappointed them. It's been a terrific season and they're far from done yet heading into the playoffs. Here's Alexander Walker. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. Pass to Reed. Here's Alexander Walker. He's defended by Hayes. Shot clock at five. Kicks it out to Anderson. Hey, from beyond the arc. On target from range. And the Timberwolves lead by two. Wow, Anderson still has that little hit in his jumper. But nice work off the catch and shoot. They need this. And Davis gets it to go. On the assist by Dinwiddie. Davis has got six. Yeah, when you make your mid-range shots, you force your opponents to adjust. And you know, the adjustments should have already been made. They know he's a good shooter from that spot. Here's Alexander Walker. Here's Towns. Davis with the defensive effort. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting a phenomenal 60% on the first. Reddish sinks the tray. Now it's a three-point Los Angeles lead. A shot Cam can make. The D must respect his three-point shot. Morris passes to Alexander Walker. Now here's Towns. Checked by Davis. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. It's going to be on Anthony Davis. And it is so tough to disrupt Towns' shot. I mean, when he shoots, he's so disciplined and locked in. Oh, so impressive. Anthony Towns. Two shots. First free throw is good. Well, the Lakers hired Darvin Ham to be their head coach back in 2022. Grant, that proved to be a great move. I agree, B.A. I mean, Ham was an assistant for a decade in the league, earned his spot as the main guy, and Darvin was a really tough player, too. I mean, he went undrafted and won a title with the Pistons against the Lakers. And so Towns nails them both. 107 left in the opening quarter. James on the wing. Reed defending. James inside. Towns on him. James. That's good. Ten points for him. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Morris passes to Towns. And here's Edwards. Back to Towns. Some solid defense from Hayes. Reddish against Anderson. And out of bounds. Minnesota will have it. T.J. Warren. He's checked in for Carl Anthony Town. For the Simple Wolves, number 24, T.J. Warren. 27 seconds left in the first. Morris deciding where to go with it. Warren for three. Buries it from three. Yeah, so underrated as a shooter. T.J. Warren, multiple years shooting over 40% from deep. Now James. Ten points for him. Yep, that one's good. James has got 12 points in the game. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Lakers. He made a big impact, scoring 12 points in the quarter. And more NBA action on 2K Sports to this.
good action in the books as we get back to a game that's been pretty close so far here. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Lakers. They came out firing from deep. It's always good for a team's confidence when you can start a game that high. And I just love playing on teams like this, passing teams. You can tell they really like playing with each other, and hopefully they keep this up. And here's Morris. He'll bring it up for the T-Wolves. Trailing by two. They've got Jackson Hayes. LeBron James out there with Prince. Then there's Cam Reddish. And it's Dinwiddie in a point guard. That's the Laker five. This team looks to him to score the ball. They feel good when he's taking the shots. Now, here is James. Misses in close. Even though he missed it, this is the exact play your offense is designed to produce. Edwards with it. Picked up by James. The shot by Alexander Walker, no good. Los Angeles has gone six of nine from three-point range. Pass to Reddish. Now Dinwiddie. James inside. There's Prince. Launches a three. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got four assists in the game. Reddish against Edwards. Doesn't go that time. Nice D from Reddish. Los Angeles has gotten 21 points so far from three-point land. They're 7 of 10. James passes to Hayes. Well, Grant is the managing director of the U.S. men's national team. You've gotten to see the wealth of international talent firsthand. It's so true, B.A. I mean, I've got so much respect for the international game. You know, over 25% of the players in the NBA right now are international players, and they produce superstar talents like Doncic, Giannis, Embiid, and Jokic. The U.S. has more competition now than ever. That free throw, no good. And he's good on the second. For Minnesota, they've gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. Edwards, the pass to Reed. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. The Lakers in the lead. Outside Reddish. Pass to James. Kicks it out to Dinwiddie. Takes the three. The Lakers with another miss. Minnesota has gone 5 of 12 from three-point range tonight. Edwards, a pass to Morris. Reed, a screen on Dinwiddie. Here's Morris. Second shot opportunity. Fires it. From out on the wing, he knocks it down. Morris has got his first points in this one. It's always risky to throw the double team at someone. You have to be aware of who you're leaving open. Prince is screen on Morris. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Anthony Edwards. That's his first foul of the game. His first personal foul. Second team foul. Two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Dinwiddie passes to Hayes. Stolen by Reed. They've done a lot of good things today, but one area they need to improve is their ball security. Pass to Alexander Walker. Outside Edwards. From 12 feet, and he gets that one. Anthony Edwards Edward. got 14 points for the game. And just working his way inside, keeping Edwards out of the paint is not an easy task. Then when he goes in, and yep, it's good. And the Lakers lead by two. And I love how he's pushing the tempo and creating for others. He does this game in and game out. Incredible. You know what it is? It's his creativity. That's making this engine run. Knocks it down from distance. Staying with it. He drank two triples in the first quarter. Now gets this one. 
James deciding where to go with it. Dinwiddie passes to Prince. Hayes with a screen on Anderson. Four on the clock. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Hayes misses. Yeah, we're not used to seeing him get bottled up like that. Wow. Reddish against Edwards. Knocked away. James against Anderson. Outside Reddish. There's the triple. Minnesota with a rebound. It's so hard to keep the defense honest when you miss wide open looks like that. Reddish against Morris. Pass to Reed. Edwards against Dinwiddie. Shot is good by Edwards. And now a three-point Timberwolves lead. It's been a dominant night for him. Staying productive throughout. James outside to the middle. And here's Anderson. He's coming off a 10-point game against the Cavs in Cleveland. Anthony Gives us a chance Edwards. to catch up with Allie the LaForce. Anthony Edwards Tyler carries a Edwards. swagger about him. He said, quote, I am the most confident person in the world. I've always felt like I'm the best at everything I did. Coach Finch said, quote, he is super confident. He's real and he's genuine. A lot of guys have a confidence that hides in insecurity. He is not that. He knows who he is as a person and as a player. Brian? Yeah, great point. Thank you, Allie. And the offensive firepower Edwards is capable of is special. I mean, we are seeing it on full display right now. And so it's James with it. He brings it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. It's a five-point game. Just too much to handle inside. As soon as you give him any room whatsoever, he is always looking to attack and make you pay. Edwards against Reddish. Edwards looking for an opening. Reed to screen on Reddish. Five to shoot. Edwards. Rebounded by the Lakers. Now here's Reddish, averaging around six a game. Here's Edwards. Out to the right wing. Dinwiddie against Morris. Pass to Alexander Walker. No good from outside. The Lakers trail. And he lobs it up. And finished off by Hayes. A beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. Here's Alexander Walker. Still no points. Reed to screen on Prince. Alexander Walker, the pass to Reed. Solid shot from a distance of about 14 feet. And the Timberwolves lead by three. Playing with good instincts. Nikhil making those around him better. To the paint. Here's Denwitty. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. That one's on Monte Morris. Heading play to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the Timberwolves. They're unselfish. They're passing the ball well, setting up teammates, playing team basketball, and their focus. And the other thing you notice is how determined they've been to get into the paint and get buckets around the rim. And the Lakers will go for a different look here. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for Hayes. Achimura comes in for James. Reeves is checked in for Prince. And Russell is subbed in for Reddish. And the Timberwolves will go for a different look here. Gobert's checked in for Reed. Towns comes in for Anderson. McDaniels is checked in for Alexander Walker. And Mike Conley is subbed in for Morris. Minnesota's gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. Towns is screen on Dinwiddie. Pass to Towns. Back to Edwards. Six to shoot. Outside Conley. 
Rebound, the Lakers. Dinwiddie outside. That one's good from Achimura on the assist by Dinwiddie. Achimura's got seven. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Towns a screen on Dinwiddie. Here's Edwards. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And we've seen Edwards grow a lot in the past few years. He has a great understanding of how to put defenders in tough spots. Anthony Edwards, two shots. Good, Edwards. And looking at Edwards, the offensive skills he has are impressive. Now he must focus on improving his defense. Prince has checked in for the Lakers. And both free throws good for Edwards. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Russell finds Prince. Davis with a screen on McDaniels. Here's Prince. And Gobert with a block. Pretty hard to get that attempt over Rudy Gobert. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. The Timberwolves have gone 8 of 15 in the second. Well, Grant, some think of Gobert as just a defensive specialist. But he's proven to be more than that. Yeah, B.A., I like how Rudy uses his height to his advantage inside. Focuses on taking high percentage shots that come to him naturally. Now here's Hachimura. He has seven. Russell with the ball. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Well, Smitty is a ball handler. D'Angelo Russell is a pretty complete player offensively. Yes, he is, B.A. He's very smart with the ball. And he knows how to create shots for others and himself. Russell. Two shots. Shoot two. Free throw is good from Russell. Yeah, they're playing a much more physical game here in the second quarter. That misses, so he splits the free throws. He is so talented. There's very little Russell can't do. It's just about the consistency, but the talent is all there. The Lakers with the ball. Time called here. The Lakers decide to talk it over. Let's have a look at the teams who have been shooting the ball the most consistently these past 10 games. Number one, Los Angeles. They've just been taking smarter, higher percentage shots, and they are hitting them with regularity right now. Here's Conley. Finished off the break. What I love about Conley, he always gives this team exactly what it needs. This time, finishing in transition. Pass to Davis. Outside Russell. Here's Reeves. No made baskets yet. Just five to shoot. It's Prince on the wing. Over McDaniels. Prince with the bucket. And the Lakers lead by two. Well, that's Prince. Understands his role. Knows exactly where to pick his spots. Pass to Edwards. Fires for three. Yes. Great play by Conley to set it up. Conley's got three assists now in this one. And boy, has this been a competitive matchup thus far. Yeah, these teams have swapped leads seven times already. And we're not even in the second half. Now here's Davis. Coming off a 22-point game against Milwaukee. Yeah, and I look at his total effect on the scoring. Both as a passer and a shooter. Incredibly productive. Pass to Russell. 
A minute 50 left in the second quarter. Back to Davis. Over Gobert. Davis can't hit. The defense is right there. Quality contest, and they threw him off his rhythm. Downs against Achimura. Shots good by Towns. And now a three-point Minnesota lead. And he is a force in the paint. Towns is such a huge presence inside for them. Reads the pass to Davis. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter. And it's getting them to the free throw line. Personal foul. Fifth team foul. At the line for the Lakers, Anthony Davis. Two shots. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. The physical gifts Anthony Davis possessed are just undeniable. He was built to cause havoc down low with his long arms and broad build. The Timberwolves making a switch here. Anderson's checked in. He does not get the second one. And Towns has got the ball here for the Timberwolves. Outside McDaniels. Kicks it out, Towns. Fires from deep. Rebound by the Lakers. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that opening. Pass to Russell. And there's the lob. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Russell. Unforced errors. These are the kinds of things that break momentum. The Timberwolves making a switch here. Moore's checked in. Two for one opportunity here. Hey, if I'm in their shoes, I go for it. Now Gobert. He's scoreless. Conley passes to McDaniels. Towns on a screen. Four on the clock. Shoots from 14. The Lakers with a rebound. Davis has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Here's Reeves. He picked up 18 points in their last win against Milwaukee. And let's not forget about the assist. His playmaking was critical for this team. And we're tied. Reeves has got his first points of the game. Getting the ball inside. Usually a pretty good wrestle. Tie game. It's, we'll be back just after halftime to get the third quarter started. 56. Thanks for tuning in. The story tonight with the Minnesota Timberwolves, they were in a close game. Uh, they're lucky to be in this. They have no energy at all on the defensive end. We know slow rotations equal easy buckets. See? See what I just did there? And they're trying to rely on the offense, Shaq, to save them. Feels like a dangerous approach. And now let's take a moment to look into the future. Here's the upcoming schedule. And for their matchup with the Clippers, if you go by the rankings, the teams look even. But to be honest, I don't think that tells the whole story, Shaq. I mean, I'm curious to see how it goes. What part of the story doesn't it tell? Lay it on the line, brother. Lay it on the line, Kenny. Glad you could join us. Ryan Anderson and crew are ready to take it away for the start of the third quarter. We've got second half action for you. And if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. And you know, Anthony Edwards has been really making it happen, guys. He's been excellent at cutting through the defense and giving them fits around the basket. He's been very effective on the move, forcing the action, getting to his spots, and finishing plays. 
So for Minnesota right now, Edwards at the two with McDaniels at the three. They have their two big men out there, Towns and Gobert, working inside. And it's Conley in at the point. They've been pretty lax with their perimeter defense, giving up a lot of three-pointers. Pass to Reeves. Puts up a deep three. The shot's good on the assist by James. James has got six assists now in the game. Minnesota shooting it well, around 55% for the game. Out to the wing. Towns down low. Checked by James. Shoots from the block. Rebound, the Lakers. And a minute played as the second half gets going. Hachimura outside. Pass to James. LeBron without hesitation. Oh, he misses the go-ahead basket. And here's Minnesota now. Puts it up from 12. And Edwards with the basket on the assist by Conley. Edwards got 30 points. These are big buckets. He's been instrumental in helping them try to close out this game. Here's Reeves, guarded by Edwards. Right side, Davis. The shot. Count that one. He's now five for eight. Give it to AD. He stays focused and he works. That's how he's able to beat good defense. Conley looking for an opening. Outside Edwards. And they double up Edwards. Pass to McDaniels. Let's the three fly. Nails it from three. McDaniels got his first three points of the game. Three out of four coming out of the half. Showing good execution on the offensive end. Hachimura, the pass to Russell. James, outside. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Minnesota in the lead. Outside Conley. Edwards is doubled. And the foul on Anthony Davis. That'll be a second foul of the game. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Towns against Hachimura. Towns down low. Three-point lead. It falls. Five for 11 in the game. Firing on all cylinders here in the third. Only one miss in five attempts. Here's Russell. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Minnesota has gone two for two from deep here in the third. Outside Edwards. They set the pick. Pass to Gobert. Over to the wing. Conley finds Edwards. Outside McDaniels. Shot clock at six. From outside, off the mark. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. The shot's good. Now just a one-point Timberwolves lead. That's why people want to play with LeBron. He's always creating good looks for his teammates. Outside Edwards. Back to Conley. Fires the three. Gets the three ball to go. Conley's got six here in the quarter. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Outside Russell. There's Davis with the three. It's rebounded by Rudy Gobert. Gobert's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Here's Edwards. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. And here's Davis. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. Pass to James. Now Davis. Guarded by Edwards. The six-footer. And it's Gobert with a rebound. The Timberwolves have gotten five of eight shots to go in the third. High post Towns. Back to Conley. And 
there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. The cleverness of Conley getting the defender to be way too handsy with him. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Timberwolves. They've been lights out from three-point land in this one. The defense hasn't been effective at stopping them, so they have just stuck with the game plan. Yeah, another thing you notice are all the assists. The ball just has energy, and everyone is getting involved. First one falls for him. He's an ultra-quick lefty with a great feel for how to run a team. Mike Conley is a tremendous asset for this franchise. And Conley drops them both. The Lakers have gone four of eight in the third. Hachimura outside. Back to Russell. Using his post moves to get the two points. Russell's got 13. The aggressive move by Russell. He's got the deep bag of tricks. So tough to stop. Towns, a screen on Russell. Pass to Towns from the arc. It's stolen by James. Russell against Conley. Russell deciding where to go with it. Now, here is James. That's Wachimura from deep. The shot's good on the assist by James. James has got nine assists in the game. Great passing. And Minnesota calls time here. It's time, everyone. Let's hear it for your Laker girl. The Lakers making a switch here. Reddish is checked in. The Timberwolves also with a sub. Anderson's checked in for McDaniels. Lakers on D. They trail by one. Left side, Anderson. Edwards against Reddish. Edwards is doubled. Just five on the clock. Gobert passes to Edwards. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. The Lakers have gotten six of ten shots to fall in this third quarter. And Anderson over to help. James, outside. Pass to Achimura. Conley against Davis. For the lead. That one's good from Achimura. On the assist by Davis. Achimura's got five points now in the quarter. Minnesota's gone three of five from downtown here in the second half. And he's going for the oop here. Out and out of bounds. bounds. Los Angeles will have it. And a look now at some of the league's impact players. The top three-point shooters at small forward. Number five, Rui Achimura. These guys show unbelievable consistency shooting the three. It's not the only skill they have, but it helps make them extremely dangerous. When the three-point shot is working for one of these fellas, that's when the defense has to be worried because any of them can get hot from behind the line. Now here's Russell. He's got 13. Hachimura outside. That shot's good. Russell making the play. And now a four-point Los Angeles lead. And this is exactly how Russell does solid assist numbers. I mean, just great delivery on that play. Conley passes to Gobert. Edwards with it. Reddish covering. Towns with room to shoot. With nobody on him, he buries that jumper. Towns has got 16 points. And that's what makes Towns so dangerous offensively. He's a threat even when he's playing off the ball. James, outside. Here's Gobert. No points yet. Anderson with it. Hachimura covering. Outside Edwards. 
Gobert with a screen on Russell. Edwards for three. Connects from downtown. And the Timberwolves lead by one. Picking up from where he left off. I lost count of how many threes he hit in the first half. Now nails this one. Hachimura against Anderson. And he lobs it up top. And stolen by Gobert. Conley against Davis. By tight Anderson. Back to Conley. Pass to Gobert. Inside. Here's Towns. He hits again. Oh, Seven for 13 and looking confident. How about the pass from Gobert? Scanning the floor well and spotting his open teammate. James outside. One reason this game is so tight is because both teams are hitting the boards with reckless abandon. Edwards finds Conley. The kick out to Edwards. Towns for three, and the three-pointer oh, goes. And now it's a six-point Timberwolves lead. One this half, two for the game. Staying active from beyond the arc. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Boy, you gotta like what we're seeing from Anthony Edwards. I mean, the ridiculous production from beyond the arc. They have to find a way to cool him down. Hayes is checked in for Los Angeles. Prince comes in for Achimura. Reed's checked in for Minnesota. Alexander Walker comes in for Anthony Edwards. To the right side. Russell against Conley. Pass to Davis. He's got a clear path. Here's Alexander Walker. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It's going to go on Jackson Hayes. I love to see Alexander Walker do this more. Use his size inside and get to the strike. The kill, Alexander Walker. Taking two shots. He's off on the first. This is the area of the game we've seen lots of improvement by Alexander Walker. Dinwiddie, he's checked in for Los Angeles. The Timberwolves also with a sub. Morris is checked in. He hits the second from the line. Now here's Dinwiddie. He's got six. Davis, a screen to stop the drought. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Towns has got six rebounds now in the game. To the middle. Here's Anderson. And down it goes. Two points. Anderson's got five. And they're playing rock-solid basketball right now. Really starting to see that lead grow. They have just nailed their halftime adjustments. That's for sure. They don't want to have to sweat this one out. They're looking to pull away. Yeah, that one's good. Their spacing isn't quite as good as it was in the first half. They may need to hit more threes to stretch that defense. Morris passes to Towns. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. And so Prince will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Pass to Davis. Dinwiddie with it. He's been a consistent contributor, averaging just over 11 a game. Got a hand on it. Great anticipation. Alexander Walker timed it perfectly. Now here's Morris. Here's Towns. Reed passes to Morris. Back to Reed. Here's Alexander Walker. Reddish covering. Clock at six. Morris for three. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got rebound number 13 for him here tonight. Pass to Dinwiddie. 110 left to play in the third. Back to Davis. Over Morris. And Davis with the basket. On the assist by Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie's got five assists in the game. 
And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. Christie's checked in for Hayes. Coming into the floor for your Lakers, number 10, Max Christie. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Here's Reddish. Here's Davis. Oh, an amazing finish with a hand right in his face. 15 points in the game. Minnesota in the lead. Morris outside. Pass to Towns. And that comes off the assist by Morris. Towns has got 11 in the second half. And what a luxury to have a big man who can score like Towns. He's been unstoppable here. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Here's Davis. And count it. Eight of 14 now. He's rolling. He's hot this quarter. Getting the shots he wants. And he's delivering. Davis against Towns. Here's Alexander Walker. Oh, and he just knocked down the buzzer beater. That might be a soul-crushing basket. What carried them into the fourth quarter? The third quarter comes to a close. The T-Wolves on top, up six. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. They've got Prince. Hayes is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Cam Reddish, and it's Mays in at the one. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. They get it back. Here's James, and slam dunk by James. Heads up play on the glass. LeBron getting into perfect position for the putback. Edwards against Reddish. Reed is screen on Reddish. It's Edwards with a drive. Here's Reed. A slam dunk by Reed. Reed. You see his link, the explosion, making sure of that one. Pass to James. Nice D from Anderson. Timberwolves shooting has been great this game. 58%. Morris with it. About one minute played here in the fourth quarter. Now Reed, six on the shot clock. Shot is good by Edwards. How about his aggressiveness from three? He caught fire in the first half. Now hits his second one since the break. He's a bad, bad man. Now here is James. That's to Prince. Three-pointer. He drops it from range. Prince has gotten better at creating his own shot, but the catch-and-shoot game is still his specialty. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Lakers. And some changes here for the Lakers. Christie's checked in for Reddish. And it's Dinwiddie in for Mays. Spencer Dinwiddie. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. Dinwiddie against Morris. Dinwiddie passes to Hayes. That one drops for him. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Now here's Anderson. Three can't hit. You want your bigs playing big. Rips it down in traffic. Here's Christie. Back to Dinwiddie. 
played it in with a nice touch off the window. And now just a two-point Timberwolves lead. Zero rim protection. Unforgivable in a tight ball game like this. And I love the play call. This is where you get the ball into the hands of your closers, where they can do something with it. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. It's on Anthony Edwards. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers, Spencer Denwitty. Makes it, and the next one could tie it up. And the Lakers making a change here. Russell has checked in, and the Timberwolves also making a change. Conley's checked in. And it's tied up with that one. And Minnesota calls time here. There's no way Coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. Welcome to the floor, the legendary and Lakers. Christie's checked in for the Lakers. Time now to hear from our reporter, Allie LaForce. Over that last break, I got a chance to hear what Chris Finch said to the team. He applauded their shooting and their shot selection, saying, we're taking the right threes, not forcing anything. Keep doing that, and they'll continue to fall. Makes the game easy, doesn't it? Thank you for that, Allie. James against Conley. Pass to Christie. Here's Prince. Five on the clock. Here's Christie. And that misses. That would have put him up. Minnesota's gone one of two from deep in this quarter. Alexander Walker, the pass to Edwards. And they double up Edwards. For three, Conley. Fires in the triple. Conley's got 11 points here in the second half. After a lackluster first half, he's taken charge offensively. We'll see how the defense responds. Russell against Conley. And there's Russell on the assist from James. Yeah, some tough points from Russell. That'll fire up this bitch. Conley passes to Alexander Walker. to Conley. The Timberwolves need to get off a shot here. Here's Anderson. Bullseye! And the Timberwolves lead by three. Look at that jumper. It's not a quick release, but it's a high release. Anderson in the face of pressure. Good on the bucket. And that was the right decision. When you're in need of a bucket, you go to your most trusted guys. And it was great execution. Clutch effort all the way around. Now here's Edwards. Outside Conley. The three is up. Prince grabs the miss. Aggressive closeout on a great jump shooter. That's how you defend against the three. Outside Russell to take the lead. Rebounded by the Timberwolves. And it didn't register as an official block, but he did everything you want in disrupting that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good wow. job of contesting Reed. without committing Reed. the foul. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of creating space. Now here's Russell. There's the three. Hits a three-pointer. Russell's got seven points here in the quarter. Yeah, that's a great shot. Third three of the game for him first in this half. Russell against Conley. Reed sets a screen. Fires the three. Yes, great play by Conley to set it up. He drops yet another dive. 
just facilitating this offense like a maestro. James against Anderson. James passes to Russell. Here's Prince. Russell finds James. Nice D from Anderson. Minnesota has gone four of six from deep thus far in the fourth. To the inside, Edwards. Well timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Edwards has got 38 points. Russell to pass to Hayes. Back to Russell. Here's James. That one is off. Nice D from Anderson. Hard to catch up when you can't hit shots. This is a quarter he liked to forget. Christie passes to Russell. Oh, good D by Edwards. Outside Conley. Pass to Anderson. Now here's Reed, guarded by Russell. The kick out to Conley. 4-3. It's Hayes with the rebound. Hayes has got four rebounds in the game. He's looking pretty unsettled at the moment. Doesn't seem like he has a great feel for his shot. Prince, the pass to Russell. And again, the Lakers, no good. The Timberwolves have gotten seven to go out of 13 attempts during the fourth. Up top, Anderson. Rebounded by the Lakers. Left side, Russell. They still need this. Pass to Hayes. Here's Prince. Throws it up high. Oh, wow! Set him up and let LeBron finish. And what's amazing to me, how little James has lost athletically. Outside Conley. To Edwards. On the wing, Alexander Walker. Out of, out of bounds. The Lakers will take it. The Lakers call timeout. And this late game timeout. Getting a breather here. Important for the players to recharge. This is where you have a chance to get rehydrated with some Gatorade. And some changes here for the Lakers. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for Hayes. Hachimura comes in for Prince. And Reeves is subbed in for Christie. Here's James. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. The defender gets caught in a bad position. LeBron powerful enough to convert through contact. Let's see what he does at the line. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Lakers, LeBron James. One shot. So it's Minnesota now. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. Now here's Edwards. He's covered closely. Outside Conley. This one for three. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Davis has got rebound number 15 here tonight. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. The ball's knocked loose. James finds Davis to take the lead. Rebound, Minnesota. Towns has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Conley up top, guarded by Russell. Back to Daniels. Pass to Conley. Here's Edwards. The kick out to Conley. The three gets the three to fall. And the Timberwolves lead by four. You know, when they're searching for a basket, they look to Mike Conley to deliver. He's never rattled in big moments. Hachimura outside. Russell with the ball. 
Hachimura outside. Back to Russell. The three is up. Knocks down the triple. Russell's got 16 in the second half. Oh, and Russell loves to remind us that he has ice in his veins. Big time bucket. Conley passes to Edwards from the arc. It doesn't go for him. And you never want to give a shooter like him a clean look. Double team on James. Pass to Reeves to take the lead. The shot's good on the assist by James. You know that he's always going to find a way to get the ball in tight situations like that and knock it down. Now here's Edwards. He's closely guarded. Great swat by Anthony Davis, giving this team energy. Classic move by LeBron James. One of the league's great competitors. The second LeBron catches the ball, you can see he's looking to rise to the occasion. Outside Edwards. Left side McDaniels. Trains the triple. Yeah, just continuing to unlock his game. If Edwards adds the playmaking component, <laughs> watch out. Downs against James. Oh, and the jam by James. The defender is left helpless to stop that. LeBron with too many tools in the toolbox. And that killer instinct. Oh, a great look there. Brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And it's Edwards with a ball for Minnesota. It's a three-point game. Outside Conley. The three is up. Money. Oh, an enormous three-pointer. There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. There's 48 seconds left in the final quarter. James, and he sinks it. Every shot in the world at his disposal. LeBron with the soft teardrop over the top. And the Timberwolves call time here. They trail by two. 44 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Four seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Right side, Edwards. From deep. Davis with a rebound. Pass to James. Outside for Davis. And nails the trade. Got a love they've just maintained their intensity even when they're this far off. They don't want to leave no chance for a comeback. Just focus on playing the right way. And the Timberwolves call time here. They're trailing by five. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Once again, your Laker girls and team. Towns passes to McDaniels. The kick out to Conley. From downtown. Rebound, the Lakers. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Anthony Edwards. It's time to take a glance again at that superb block. <laughs> Amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages them to keep attacking on the offensive end. Eleven seconds left to play in the fourth. And so they choose to intentionally foul. That's his first foul. The fourth team foul. That's a line for Los Angeles. LeBron James. Two shots. 
And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to go. LeBron James has always been a team first guy. He will score, rebound it, and pass it. And he does get the second one. And that increases the lead to six. Here's Conley. Towns outside. Fires from deep. Oh, the trifecta! Oh, and an all-out effort from Towns. Putting the team on his back and getting them the shot they need. And the Lakers call time here. They're on top by three. Three seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Yeah, and that was a smart move. I mean, you have to foul right there. You just don't want them to run out the clock. At the line for the Lakers, LeBron James. He hits the first one, and that gives him a four point cushion. And no one's more familiar with this situation than LeBron. This team leans on him even harder in the clutch. And so he drops them both. And it's a five-point game. Big moment at the line. As poised as you get, this thing is done. And so it's the Lakers with the W. Boy, a hard-fought game. They did a great job of holding on to the lead at the end. Yeah, get the coffee, because that's the way to close. You're going to face some obstacles in the game, but they overcame every one. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. All right, thanks, guys. D'Angelo, some great basketball tonight. Talk about the winning habits this team is forming. Keeping it simple on the offensive end, limiting our errors on the defensive end. I think that piles up. We stay solid throughout the whole game. It's just simple, man. I think the, the simple we keep it, the better we are as a team. Keep it simple. What a great reminder. Thanks, D'Angelo. Allie, thank you as always.